Welcome back everybody, I am Zandrio, and we're back with more Tales of Mad Jail. In the previous episode, we got our ass handed to us repeatedly in the sandworm lair, and uh, I believe in this episode I'm going to go back for more. Uh, it might be a stupid thing to do, but I'm going to do it anyways, because I just might be stupid. So I got buried over there a few times. Or I, I guess I only died from being buried once. It was it was pretty rough. Well, we we got a fight on our hands. Let's see what we got here. Even these uh, random fights, like in the middle of the wilderness like this, are extremely nasty. There's a halfling using luck of the little foot. He seems aware. He's aware of my presence. Well, I'm going to charge him. Charge! Take that, halfling. Little mother. Turn my infusion on. Let's just smack the living crap out of this dude. I, I can't stun him. My stun is on cooldown. I'm not sure why it's on cooldown. I'm stunned. Well, he's stunned too, and he's going to be stunned longer than me, I, I do believe. Or is he not stunned? Crap. Shield wall, true grit, earthen barrier, blocking, battle shout. This dude's a badass. Let's stun him. Okay, I can't stun him. It's quite the bummer. We can poison him, though. He's not really hurting me. I, I should be fine. I haven't even had to use my my healing spell yet. So I, I think I'll be okay on this dude. Just tear him a new one here. Take that. He got stunned that time. Hell yeah. No problem. What have we got here? Ooh, all kinds of goodies. All kinds of goodies! Special effect and weapon crits. Wounds the target. That's a one-handed sword. Shield. That does me no good. Armor. That might, might be good armor. I'll, I'll have to look at that armor. Uh, I'm not sure why the little halfling was packing around two shields with him, though. That doesn't really make that much sense to me. Whatever. Where's that lovely armor? I wanted to look at that stuff. Oh, nope. Nope, not as good. That's a bummer. Hostile spotted the northwest. Northwest. Ivun the Thalor. Oh, what's up, Ivun? How you doing today? I'm going to run away for just a moment while my charge charges up, and then I'll charge her. And I'll stun her. And I'll pummel the living crap out of her. No problem. That was a rogue. You can tell by the rogue loot. Daggers, daggers. Lots of daggers. Leather armor, leather cap. That, that could be good. I'm, I'm going to have to look at the leather cap. Because uh, I don't remember what I'm wearing. Strength, cunning, will. Six damage on hit. Oh, that's a, that's a pretty good one. I I think that's going to be an improvement over this uh, little hunk of junk right here. This one gives me a couple of resistances and changes some of my damage to temporal. But no, I think I'd rather wear this thing. That thing's pretty good. It's pretty good. Awesome. Is there anyone else here? I guess not. Alright, my, my task was to get back to this sandworm lair, finish clearing the damn thing out. We got another adventuring party to deal with first. I've been ambushed. Oh noes! Oh noes! Ooh, it's a mage. Rikri the halfling. Alright, Rikri. I ain't scared of you, Rikri. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait, I can hit everything around me. Where's my uh, death dance? There we are. Ooh. Ooh. Shout. 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 I can hit three dudes with that. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Now let's use... Wait. Wait a damn minute. 
My daunting presence is not on. Needs to be on. I need to heal myself. Ooh, I'm getting smacked hard. I have had enough! 105 darkness damage. Can I retreat? I, I want to retreat. I'll jump back. Can I jump back over that tree? No, I cannot jump back over that tree. I've got 13 stinking life. Ah, uh, no. R okay, rod of recall. Rod of recall. Use. No. No. I have died. Well. I did not make it very far. Did not make it very far at all. I un oh, I unlocked a bunch of stuff. I unlocked the campaign, the arena. Uh, gained level 10. I unlocked the summoner class. I unlocked the archmage class. Hell yeah. Let let's let's start with an archmage. Now, now that I've died once, I've been defeated once. Kind of bummed about that. But it gives me a chance to play with new classes which have been unlocked. The Archmage. The Archmage devotes his whole life to the study of magic above anything else. Most Archmage I like basic skills that others take for granted, like general fighting sense, but they make up for it with their raw magical power. Archmage I start with a knowledge of many schools of magic. However, they usually refuse to have anything to do with necromancy. Most Archmage I have been trained in the secret town of Anglewyn and possess a unique spell to teleport to it directly. Their most important stats are magic and willpower. Life per level minus four. Yeah, it's gonna it might, it might be rough. What's gonna be the best magic magic class? The Shalor has some some fancy magic bonuses, but it has minus two to strength, which makes me think it's gonna have a hard time carrying stuff. What about a dwarf? Nope, bad magic. Oh, the higher human has pluses to all all his stats. That's interesting. And they can regenerate wounds once in a while. Nope, nope. I think I'm going to go... Uh, I'm going to go Shalor. We'll make a pure mage. Shalor and Elf. Uh, limited extra lives. At level 1, 2, 5, 7, 14, 24, and 35, get one more life. Okay. Uh, I think that's what I'm going to do. We're not we're not going to play roguelike mode because this game is rough. This game is so rough. Let's do it. What do we got to start with? This should be this should be quite a bit different than uh, than the berserker I was using before. Supposedly. Willpower and magic are my two main stats. Magic increases spell power and the effect of spells. Willpower is my mana. Well, we're going to put two into magic, one into willpower. That, that's how we'll do it for now. Let's see, see what stats we got here. What stats we got here? State of deep concentration, increasing your spell power by five. I already have that. Flame! Bolt of fire. Doing 70.28 fire damage over three turns. At level five would create a beam of flames. Well, that's fancy. Earth. Armor buff. Water. Glacial fumes. An AoE cold spell. Lightning! Lightning! Beam of lightning. 26 to 79 damage. We got chain lightning there. Feather wind and thunderstorm. Right, Phantasm's tree. We got like light stuff, invisibility stuff. All, all kinds of fancy stuff going on here. Ether, meta, and temporal. Temporal's gotta be time time stuff. Yeah, haste. Haste and slow, I would imagine. Time shield, time prison, essence of speed. Well, we are going to be a fire mage at this point. I, I do believe I, I'm going to go for a fire mage. 
so I can't get it to level 3 until I level up, so we'll have to put our second point somewhere else. We'll put it into arcane power. Yes, yes indeed. That is a sustained talent that costs 50 mana to sustain. Interesting. Grace of the Eternals ups your speed. Phase door. Oh, now that'll be handy to escape with. I, I should probably get some points into that. Because... I, I'm gonna need to be escaping from stuff. Someone's an eye. Not really that interested in that. Ooh, uh, a self-heal. A self-heal. We're gonna take that one. Cunning survival tree is locked. I don't care. What do I have for inscriptions, anyways? I can still learn two new slots, but I need a category point. Oh. It's not telling me anything. Yes, accept the changes. I'm an archmage in a world that still fears magic. The people of Anglewin have been trying to mend the world for well over 2,000 years now, but they do so in secret. You've lived and trained most of your life in Anglewin, calling many people there your friends, but you've grown restless as of late. You want to see the world, maybe even help in what ways you can. But for now, Anglewin still needs you. The Abashed Expanse, a part of Isle that was torn apart and thrown into the void during the Spellblaze, is quickly becoming unstable. You've been tasked to investigate and fix the problem. Wait a minute. What's up, Archimage Terillion? Plan on going into the wild world, looking for adventures. Yes, that is good. Maybe you might want to get an adventure and help angle one. Okay. During the spell blaze, the world was torn apart, literally. The part of it that we now call the Abashed Expanse was ripped from the world and thrown into the void between the stars. We managed to stabilize it, and it is now orbiting Aeol. Recently, we have noticed a disturbance there. If we do nothing, it will crash onto Isle, bringing much destruction in its wake. Because it was once part of a land we know well, we can teleport you there. You, you will need to stabilize three wormholes by firing any attack spells of them. The instability is also to your advantage there. Your simple phase door spell will be fully controllable. Think you can help us? Sure! Oh, it's teleporting me right there? Well... I am in outer space. I'm in frickin' outer space, folks. What have we got here? Healing. Uh, make it run fast. We don't need that right there. We'll... Hey. 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 How come I didn't go into the bar? Damn it. Where's my running fast stuff? It needs to be on a bar. So unacceptable that that thing did not go onto a bar. All right, we'll, we'll we'll throw it over here. We don't need it necessarily. But flame is going to be my main damage spell. Lightning will be secondary if flame is on cooldown, I guess. Arcane power needs to be turned on. It sustains 50 mana. Well, I've only got 85 mana. This one costs 12 mana. Eh, that'll be okay. Shoot a fireball! Oh, look at that! I'm a badass lightning! Hell yeah, we can we can kite. Where, where, where are these idiots? Fire! Oh my goodness! That mage is badass! Let's rest. Oh, this mage is badass! So supposedly my phase door is fully controllable here. Uh, Bethel, avoid, avoid. Did, does that teleport me to another? Nope. So where's my phase door? Oh, look at that! I can teleport to wherever the frickin' hell I want. Hello. Just kicking the living crap out of things. There's no, only three cooldown on that phase door. Boy, I, I can teleport all over the damn place. What? What? 
What? I have no idea what happened. Did I fall off the edge of the world? I, I think I very well may have fallen off the edge of the world. So, I'm a noob. I'm a noob. I, I fully admit it. There's no shame in it. No shame whatsoever. Let's see, can I go down? No. Boy, this, this, this phase door is a little unpredictable. A little unpredictable. Just kick the crap out of these dudes here real quick. Avoid blast projectile coming at me. Okay, I, I can dodge those projectiles. That's probably what happened. I didn't dodge one of those phase blasts or something. And I am a, a complete and utter wimp. Oh, this phase door sucks. Phase door sucks. Go, there you go. Phase door again. Oh, it don't have the range. Okay, it, it goes to red. It goes to red. I, I can't phase door that far. That explains the issues I was having. I, I was being a, a, a total noob. Oh, oh, come on. Come on now. Come on. What the hell? Am I, am I stuck over here? Really, am I stuck? I don't want to be stuck. Go! Uh-oh. Kill! Kill, kill, kill! I need to move. Projectiles coming at me. Uh, number three, number three. Lightning! Oh my goodness! I am a complete wuss! I'm a complete and utter wuss! We must destroy these people quickly. Okay, heal myself. Oh my hell! This is, this is gonna be a rough class to play. This is what they call a glass cannon. It's definitely what they call a glass cannon. This teleport is kind of random. I'm not sure where it's going to bring me sometimes. Oh, come on. Stop bringing me that way. Come on. there, bring, Go over there. What the hell? Is this the wormhole I'm supposed to kill? What I started next to? It absorbs... Absorbs energies and stabilizes. I can now use it to travel. Okay. It's a stable wormhole. The hell am I... Is that all I'm supposed to do here? Stabilize three wormholes. The floating islands are not stable. It might teleport randomly. Well, that, that explains... That explains my my issues here. Totally explains why I was having such a problem figuring out what was going on. Because the freaking islands are moving around randomly. Alright, well I'm not sure what's going on here. But I don't see any more portals here. So I'm going to go ahead and get the hell out of here. Oh, okay. It, it brought me to another... It brought me right to another place. Alright, we can deal with that. Die. Oh, this is dangerous. This is dangerous. Oh, I'm gonna run out of mana. Alright, rest. Rest for zero terms. Hostile spotted. Come on, rest. I need mana. I need mana badly. Phase door. Oh, oh, come on, phase door. No, it's gonna get. It's gonna bring me to more critters. I don't like that idea. Don't like that idea. Let's go this way. We might be able to get enough mana back to cast a stinking spell. Not 
Not enough mana yet. Retreat! No, oh, this dude's in the way. <laughs> I'm in a bad place. I'm in a bad place. I'm in such a bad place. Okay, the, the, the critter went away for some reason. So may, maybe I'll be okay. Wait, I have a teleport to angle one spell. I have a shielding rune also. Well now, why don't I not have the shielding rune on? Oh, because it only lasts a few turns, that's why. Alter the flow of energies through a staff? Call in which aspect of the staff? The star. Call forth which element? Physical. I hurt myself! I'm experimenting, and, and apparently that's a bad idea. Experimenting with magic. Hold on. I got mana surge. That'll help me out. That'll give me some mana. Kill. Kill. Things are hitting me. Things are hitting me. Okay, am I going to survive? Oh, I was able to rest. Okay, uh, we've kind of figured out how this how this level's going to work. I've already lost a stinking life on this character, which it, it, it kind of sucks. Uh, I have zero lives left already. <laughs> I am I'm pathetic. I am simply pathetic. But we got a good little start here. We figured out how these uh, silly teleporting islands work. We gotta, we gotta uh, seal a couple more of these portals. So next episode, that's what we'll do, and uh, we'll see you then. Thanks for watching.